Hey guys, it's Kyle Bennett with HardOCP.com. And what we got in today from Iceman Cooler is the CPU AMD Ryzen TR4 in black. This is part number ICE TR4B1. And uh, from Iceman Cooler. So this is another Threadripper water block. Let's see what we got here. Got some... Uh, Frag Harder Disco Light Control Module and a little bit of Thermal Tim and a spatula in there. So we have an acrylic machine top. We do have inlet outlets. Nice looking float plate in there. Very nice looking coal plate. My initial thought on the hold down springs on this is they're kind of weak for TR4 for Threadripper. We'll see how that goes. Let's take it apart and see what's inside. So these are Allen headed bolts. These are uh, two millimeters. <music> Got a nice heavy aluminum plate. Here is obviously our frag harder lights. And there is our cold plate. All looks very nicely machined. This is all one piece. We can see where it's been machined out here. Bottom there is very, very flat. Nicely done, nickel plating, nice machine work. Of course, we have our flow. Excuse me, where our flow comes in, jets in the top into the middle. You can see this little recess that's cupped here where the flow comes in, and then back out both ways. So, what we have learned is that may not be the most efficient way of doing it. So going back and using our uh, trusty die package, we see that these fins are missing about five millimeters on each side of that die, although we cover them side to side. And much like we saw with, um, I believe it was the Coolant's block, so our jetting's cooling our dies from end to end rather than coming out and jetting across the sides where you'd have uh, more cool coolant flowing across those actual die footprints. And we got another seal right there. So there's a little bit better shot of our jetting plate, how it's keyed on those four points right there, and sets down and delivers us the coolant path in and out. So that is the Iceman uh, Ryzen Thread Ripper water block. We're going to get to testing it here soon. This is Kyle Bennett with hardocp.com.